वेलकम बैक टू द डोमेन रेसर एंड दिस इज वन ऑफ द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट वीडियो इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट द ई कॉमर्स सिक्योरिटी टू सिंप्लीफाई द कॉन्सेप्ट वी आर डिवाइडिंग दिस वीडियो इन टू थ्री पार्ट फर्स्ट वन इज वॉट इज ई कॉमर्स सिक्योरिटी सेकेंड वन इज वॉट आर द वेज बाय विच ई कॉमर्स वेबसाइट गेट हैक and third one is how do you secure your e-commerce website in this case we are going to share you what are the ways by which you can able to secure your e-commerce web service so let's begin with the process the very first we need to understand what is e-commerce security when we talk about e-commerce e-commerce is nothing but we are selling a product and the customers are buying a product and in this case if customer is buying a product he is using his card or bank details or any sensitive information that may leads to get the fraud in this case it is the full responsibility of e-commerce business owner to secure the customer information when we talk about the security and security is one of the most important feature of e-commerce and without that the e-commerce business cannot be successful if the e-commerce business is not secured properly in this case the business owner is putting his customer personal information business and his brand in the risk so basically e-commerce security is the most important factor when we talk about the statistic almost 29% website that is nothing but one third of e-commerce website are under bot attack that harms the e-commerce web hosting and for this reason you should always has to go with a secured e-commerce web hosting provider and in this case domain racer is one of the best e-commerce hosting provider if you wanted to know more about that please watch this video because in this video we are going to share you all the possible reasons how do you secure and also going to explain what are the features that you need to consider while choosing a web hosting company let's move to the second part in this we are going to cover what are the attacks that happens on e-commerce business the very first and the most popular attack is mysql injection if you wanted to know more about mysql injection just go to the youtube and type mysql practices you will get a lot of videos and by watching that videos you can able to understood what are the possible ways by which the any e-commerce website can get into mysql injection to secure it we always has to use a secure platform like magento wordpress so these are the most popular ways but when we talk about this cms in this case security also a part of that so you can able to watch a video guide given in the description in that we had already explained why the wordpress website get hacked and also the another video you should have to watch how to secure your wordpress website but in this video we are be specifically talking about e-commerce business so if you talk about a mysql injection there are three types but we are not going into depth of it so you can able to just make sure that your website should be mysql injection proof how for that you should have to be a very powerful system from the back end we are not talking about web hosting company we are talking about the crm or a content management system that may be wordpress e-commerce laravel or other applications so please make sure that if you are developing from the scratch and if you have a development knowledge then you should have to consider this point very carefully now move to the second type by which e-commerce website get hacked that is nothing but cross site scripting so what is the meaning of cross site scripting it is also called as xss attack it is a client side code attack and so to prevent it you should have to write a code very effectively to avoid any client side code attack and the next one is malware infection what actually the malware infection malware infection is nothing but that take your personal information or erase the data or they can misuse your information these are the various types by which 
the malware attacks can be performed. When we talk about malware, malware will steal your personal information, erase your website data and infect your live visitors and even hold your website for infinite time. And to avoid this, like malware attack, virus attack, infections, in this case, the web hosting provider play an important role. When we talk about Domain Racer, in cPanel you will get this option. So you can able to scan your entire website. The video is already given in the description. So you can able to watch that video and learn how to scan your website for viruses, malware and worms. It will be act like a antivirus for your system. And the next one is DDoS attack. So this is the most popular attack always happen on the e-commerce businesses. So to avoid that, you should have to pick a best web hosting company because DDoS attack protection is not handled from your end. It should be handled from the server provider end. In this case, you can able to choose Domain Racer to avoid DDoS attack. And the last one is brute force attack. And to prevent that, the applications like WordPress, Laravel and other like Magento that helps to give you and various options to avoid the brute force attack. But in Domain Racer, in the C panel, we are having the option. So by default, our system can able to avoid any DDoS attack or a brute force attack on your website. So no worry about that. Now we had completed our second part about why e-commerce website or what are the ways by which e-commerce website get hacked. Now we are going to move to the third part and the most important, how do you secure your e-commerce business? So you have to follow all the rules to secure your e-commerce business. Whenever we are talking about security practices, always make sure that choose a right web hosting company. In this case, we always recommend you to go with a domain racer because we have the various options like DDoS protection, brute force attack protection, virus scanner, antivirus softwares are available. So indirectly, we can able to say if you choose the best web hosting company, so your half job of web or e-commerce security will get satisfied. So now we will move towards the next point. Before that, one more thing has to be make sure whenever you run your e-commerce website, that time SSL should be there. So without SSL certificate, please do not run your e-commerce business. When we talk about Domain Racer, we are offering free of cost SSD storage. SSL certificate is also free for a lifetime and you will get a better service all the time. So now we will move to the next point. In this case, MySQL injection is one of the problem, right? So in this case, you have to always make sure one thing, always perform MySQL test on your e-commerce business. So you can able to easily understand if there is any lag or any attacks or any miscellaneous information is present in your MySQL. So basically here you have to perform a MySQL test every week. So you can able to make sure that your MySQL is secured one. It is not a part of web hosting company. You have to check manually from your side because here it directly connected with your website code. So you can able to say that this is a part of development. Third way by which you can able to secure your e-commerce is very first take the minimum information possible from the user because here, if you are running an e-commerce business, you need information like name, email ID, address. But here, you do not need his personal information like birth date, birth year, his favorite color. It is not required at all. So basically, take only that information that we need for our business. And whenever possible, avoid any sensitive information storing in your system. That way, you can able to avoid any security risk of a customer. So always make sure that only keep the necessary information in your system. Now we are moving towards the third point. In this, we always have to make sure that our system should be up to date. So if you are using plugin or theme, always make sure that it should be up to date. And when we talk about the fourth point, whenever you are using any third party code, always understood one thing. If the code is not well optimized, so in this case, let's say an example of e-commerce website in that you have added a payment gateway platform with the help of plugin or add-ons. So in this case, if that add-on 
has some vulnerability then your e-commerce business might get hacked so basically always make sure that use a trusted plugins or add-ons for your e-commerce business so that is the one of the most reasons why the e-commerce websites are getting hacked so always make sure that it looks very simple but you have to always make sure this thing before doing any security risk getting hacked your website because this is one of the most important factor we always share with user so this means if your system is up to date and you always use a trusted plugins or add-ons then you should not have to worry about these codes this means you have a security already done on your system let's move to the next point in this always take a backup of your system every week at least because if you take a backup then you are taking care of your e-commerce business if it is getting any kind of malware attacks or any viruses so in this case you have to disinfect them while disinfecting might be your website get crashed so in this case you need a backup to restore it so this way you can able to secure your e-commerce web hosting now the last point is whenever you are choosing any web hosting companies let me share you the most important factors of web hosting companies the very first uh, we are talking about a domain reserve in this case you will get a uh, things like ddos attack protections second you will get a brute force attack protections we have this special tool that helps you to find the threads and the vulnerability in e-commerce plugins so you can say that magento wordpress joomla that kind of plugins can be able to find the malicious codes available from the system the next one is you will get a strong five year security to your e-commerce business so these are all the things you have to consider to secure your e-commerce business if you have any query or you need additional information or you need any other video guide please comment below for now like share and subscribe this video so we will get a new energy